Hi guys, I'm at the High Street Fields here in Bellingham, Mass. A couple of days ago I went for a walk back in the woodlands. There's a nice trail system back here and there's a few spots that I want to check out. So my husband's with me this time. So let's head on in. Go to the right of the field. You'll see the bat house. This is the main trail. So I imagine this must get flooded. Nice little footbridge to cross over. Beautiful lady slippers. I love them. You'll find markers on some of the trees. A ton of white pine trees back here. The other day when I went for a walk, I came across this tree that's been cut down right in the middle of the path and it's just dangling there. And I posted it on Facebook and Instagram and it intrigued a lot of people. Pretty crazy. Here you can get a better look at this tree. This is a trail I'll take another time because I want to get to that bridge by the Charles River. but. Like I said, there's a bunch of trails down here to explore. Now we're down at the Charles River, and across the way, you can see this tree where a beaver's been showing. It's not going to be up that much longer. So that's where we're headed. We want to cross that bridge. This is the path that leads down to the bridge. Oh, I made it under this the other day. I can do it again. It's a little difficult for me with my knee. Oh, let's see. Damn, that's tough. Yeah, you can do it, Brenda. Yes. Look at that. I'm getting stronger and stronger by the day, guys. And the mosquitoes are getting stronger and stronger by the minute as we get closer to the water. Alright, I'm gonna do this. Goodness gracious. Oh. Alright, now I gotta go the rest of the way. Is this thing going to be uh, secure to walk on? Yeah, right up the middle. Dear God. <laughs> oh boy. Alrighty. The Adventures of Nature's Fairy. Yay. Alrighty. I did it. Oh, we're coming up to railroad tracks. Now, wouldn't that be cool to see a train? So I don't know if there's a trail on the other side or not. This is too steep for me to go up. I don't think it's even showing in the video. And I'm sure that is an old sign that said no trespassing. Well, we really should pay attention to where we're going because we both walked into stinging nettle. And they are not kidding when I say it stings. There he is, guys. Sorry, zoomed up pretty far and it's shaky. I don't know why it seems more scary going back. <laughs> oh boy. All right, you can do this, Brenda. Oh, how I love the sound of flowing water. Thank goodness there isn't any poison ivy right here. I'm coming, hon. I gotta go back underneath that tree. For the love of nature, what I will do. Oh my god, I have to drop the camera. Not drop it, but dangle it. Use both hands. Uh oh! 
All right, you guys get seasick watching that? <laughs> oh my gosh, that was great. We're back at these two trails. We've decided we're going to go to the right to see where this leads us to. Going. Well, this is as far as we're going. My God, I'm glad I got my old sneakers on. I just recently bought new uh, hiking sneakers. Don't have, them, don't have them on, which I'm glad. Look at that, yuck. Look guys, a little baby toad. guy have a nice life what's it say it says conservation yeah. I hear the train alrighty so we're on private property but we're in the easement area alrighty so as long as we stay on the trail nobody can shoot us <laughs> we don't want to be shot nope look at all these lady slippers to get them in on the camera. There's just like a ton of them. God, that's awesome. Here's more. Chris has an incredible sense of direction. I would have gotten lost or I would have had to beetle back, but this is where we started off. can't wait to come back here in the summer. Even though it feels like summer, it's really hot. But there should be lots of mushrooms down here. really love this place. There's a red-winged blackbird. We've been walking for an hour and a half. Not too much longer till we get back to the car, but this is a great place. I hope everybody had a chance to connect with nature. Thanks for coming along with us. Peace, love, and joy. Always be humble, always be kind. See you next time, guys.